Namaste dears, welcome back to our EVS class. Hope all of you did the work that I had given you. What was that? Classify the plants around you. Did you do that? Classify the plants around you on the basis of their peculiarities. What are the different types of plants? Can you name them? Creepers. Give me the name of any creeper. Creepers. Bitter gourd, pumpkin, etc. Small plants. Small plants. Name some small plants. Tulsi, basil, hibiscus, rose, etc. And the next one. Big plants. That is easy for you. Name some big plants. Okay. Tell me. Coconut tree, banyan tree, mango tree, jackfruit tree, etc. Okay. I think now all of you got an idea of different types of plants that we can see around us. Today we are going to discuss about bamboo plants bamboos do you know what is meant by bamboos everywhere we can see everywhere in kerala we can see bamboos different uses are there for the bamboos bamboos you know toti we are using to pluck mangoes jackfruit etc for that we are using a long stick in malayalam we call it toti for that we are using bamboo for making furniture for making furniture bamboo we are using bamboo bamboo furniture we can get bamboo furniture everywhere in kerala and bamboo hut Making huts, we can use bamboo. Okay. And making paper. The main use of that bamboos are making paper. That, about that, paper making you can study in your higher classes. Just keep in your mind, bamboos are using for making papers. Okay. So, this class we are discussing about bamboo. Many uses are there for bamboos. We can make papers with bamboo. We can make papers. We can make heart. We can make furniture. Okay. And see. Do you know that bamboo is also a. Bamboo is in grass family. That's not a plant. Bamboo is not a tree. Bamboo is not a creeper. It is in grass family. It's a new thing, no? Bamboos are not a tree. It's a... It is in grass family. Largest plant in the grass family is bamboos. Bamboos are the largest plant. It's not a tree. It's not a creeper. It's not a small plant. It's a grass. And the biggest plant in the grass family is bamboos. And the next thing was about the bamboos. What is that? It blossoms only once its lifespan. In its whole life. Only one time it blossoms and after that, the bamboo plant dries, dies. So, only once in its lifespan, the bamboo plant blossoms. So, two points you got it. Many uses are there for bamboos. We can make pepper, we can get, we can make furniture. We can make huts. 
with this bamboo we can make paper we can make hearts we can make furniture and the next thing bamboo is also a grass and in this grass family the biggest plant is bamboo largest plant in the grass family is bamboo and it blossoms once in its life span and it deposits thousands of seeds once it blossoms it deposits thousands of seeds and these seeds known as bamboo grains these seeds knows bamboo grains okay these seeds knows bamboo these seeds known as bamboo grains okay this is a mistake knows not knows known as the seeds known as bamboo grains so first thing the largest plant in the grass family bamboos are the largest plant in the grass family it blossoms only once in its life span it deposits thousands of seeds and the seeds known as bamboo grains and these grains have medicinal values the bamboo grains have medicinal values and use as food and use as food so my dears listen carefully today we discussed about only one poem what is that bamboos we can see bamboos all over in kerala many uses are there we can use bamboos for making paper making hearts making furniture and now copy this what are the main points about bamboos bamboos are the largest plant in the grass family once more say with me bamboos are the largest plant in the grass family bamboos are the largest plant in the grass family grass bamboos are not trees not small trees not creepers it is are the bamboos are in grass families largest plant in the grass family bamboos and the next one bamboos blossom only once in its life span first one bamboos are in gra from grass family bamboos from grass family second one it blossoms once in its life span third one that time it deposits thousands of seeds bamboos are from grass family it blossoms once in its life span it deposits thousands of seeds and these seeds known as bamboo grains is grow medicinal values and used as food 1 2 3 4 5 points we learn about bamboos i repeat all of you listen here don't worry only this point you learn about bamboo we discussed about bamboo only that point we discussed today bamboo bamboo okay so one first point bamboos are from grass family grass remember that word grass family bamboos grass family yet bamboos blossoms once in its life span bamboos blossoms once in its life span third point these bamboos deposits thousands of seeds once in its life span it blossoms that time it deposits thousands of seeds these seeds known as bamboo grains and these grains have 
many medicinal values and used as food. Okay. Five points. Once more. Say with me. Ready? First one. Bamboos from grass family. Simple sentence. Bamboos are from grass family. It blossoms once in its lifespan. It deposits thousands of seeds. These seeds known as bamboo grains. These bamboo grains having medicinal values and used as food. Okay, got it? Copy this and learn this. I'll ask the question tomorrow, next class. Main points. Only bamboos. Either the page I'll send you through our WhatsApp group. So you just learn this. Only one point. What is that? Bamboo. Once more, repeat with me. Bamboo. Bamboos are from grass family. Mm -hmm. They blooms once in an its once in its lifespan. It deposits thousands of seeds. These seeds known as bamboo grains. And these bamboo grains have medicinal values and used as food. Got it? Okay. Read that page. Copy this page, uh, this one to your notebook. I'll send the send this photograph and the page's photograph also. So copy to your notebook and learn this. Okay, see you tomorrow.